Alrighty, uh, this is all new. So, this is the PlayStation 5 Pro. I'll need to work on my titles a bit, but we are playing the PlayStation 5 version of Rage of the Dragons Neon, I think it's called, uh, and we're using the Brook 5 Gen 5X board. Uh, and it's a new setup in terms of I'm using a Raspberry Pi now. Um, so I've kind of done it as a bit of a simple one, just to try to make sure that the system is all working. So as you can see, green line, and we can follow that through, uh, and that's been captured nicely. Um, in the middle, I've set it up so that it follows the um, command history. And then at the bottom, I had it following the um, hitboxes. Now, I'll just let that play through. The slightly embarrassing thing is I haven't used this for a long time. Uh, so I've kind of forgotten the controls of my own program. Uh, but as you can see, the hitbox for the duck moves from kind of his chest down to his the middle of his uh, abdomen. Um, it's, it's a bit of a funny one. And I'll do a further thing in just a second. But essentially, the command history appears a frame before the hitbox moves, which appears a frame before the, uh, the um, animation seems to start for the ducking animation. I'll go back and test the, uh, the um, like a jab or something like that, just to be sure. Uh, I'm sure there's a quick way to do this rather than scrolling all the way through. But like I said, I forgot my own controls for my own program. Um, so what I wanted to do, hopefully this won't blow it up, is that. And so now, if we play through, uh, it should have him ducking in the middle there. So that all seems to work. Uh, seems to be fairly consistent there. I'll check with jabs uh, or some other rapid attack, but normally ducks are fairly fast in terms of when they come out. Um, so I'll just let this one play through, just so we've demonstrated all the frames. Uh, essentially, Rage of the Dragons on PS5 with a PS5 controller, so that the, the Gen 5X uh, is about 50. Let's just check it. Whew, so 51 milliseconds for the command history. It was 68 for the hitbox to move and 84 for the animation. I'll let the uh, video...